Hello! And welcome to my attempt to play this game called the Cosmic Wheel Sisterhood. I'm Marini, and I'm waiting for Era, who should be showing up at some point. Every time I click away, you get to see my beautiful Jeff screen. <laughs> So if I want to see what's happening in chat, I've got to like click away and you get to look at Jeff. So <laughs> anyway, uh, I'm going to start with the content warning. This game tackles sensitive themes and content, including self-harm, suicide, discrimination, gender dysphoria, depression, anxiety, nudity, sexual themes, cruel, crude language and use of legal drugs. All right. I wonder if how bad it's going to be. All right. New game. Hey, Scotty. This is just until Aira gets done with work, and then <clears throat> we'll go back into Mother 3. Eternal Void, heed the words of a prisoner. I beg of you, send me a curse to break this immortal isolation. Hear the chant my mentor once forbid me to recite. Stranger to my soul, invade my body. Stranger to my soul, invade my mind. What is happening? <laughs> Grant me an eye to see beyond my torment. Take my pride, my sorrow, my chains. Turn them into power, wisdom, revenge. Stranger to my soul, invade my magic. Stranger to my soul, become my faith. That's a beautiful song. It feels great to be awakened again. Hmm. Who are you? Whoa! My name is Fortuna. I am a witch. Abramar says, Why did you summon me? Because I would rather lose my pride than my sanity. Daddy Abramar is best shrimp. You know, he is kind of like a cosmic shrimp. <laughs> Sounds fun. Tell me more. I was condemned to exile by the leader of my coven. Today marks the 200th year of my millennium-long sentence. And I can't take it anymore. I need your help. Why do you use... What do you use as a clock? Humanity's cradle. Planet Earth. Oh, 200 human years. That's quite some time. I feel you. I had been in prison for 5,402 years until you summoned me. Isolation can really do a number on you. I will help you. I shall become your familiar. Dude, we're gonna get a shrimp familiar. <laughs> Is that an eye right here? Woo! Thank you, Abramar. Now, get comfortable. We are going to seal a contract. Oh! <laughs> First of all, allow me to express my gratitude. The music is fantastic. <laughs> I am really thankful you freed me from my cosmic prison. Um, of course, you are welcome. Is something the matter? Not really. It's just after all the reading I did about behemoths. I didn't expect your behavior to be so mundane. Whoa, mundane. That hurt. Oh, I mean, you're still intimidating, but I always pictured you speaking in archaic poetry or something like that. Ha 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 ha! I like you. I like you so much, I'm going to let you pick the terms of our contract. You will still have to pay a high price for my magic, though. I'm well aware of that. I won't back off. All right, then let's begin your training. The ceremony is five days long. Let me know when you're ready to begin. Right now. <laughs> you are already my favorite master. The first day is the easiest one, an interview so we can get to know each other. Lesson one, admittance. Tell me about yourself. What is your specialty? I am a fortune teller. Ah, oh, one of my favorites. Would you mind doing a reading for me? I can't. As part of my sentence, 
Adana. Adana? Ad Adana? Adana? Banished my tarot deck. Adana is the leader of my coven. Wow, you must have done something really grave to get exiled and deprived in your man of your magic. Adana? Yeah. I think the A-E is more like an A, but I'll do Adana. That sounds better. I foretold the falling of my coven. Bleak. But how are your visions your fault? After my premonition, the coven was consumed by despair. Many witches came to me for counsel to prepare for the end times. Adana didn't like that. She holds supreme authority in our coven, and she decided to exile me to this wandering asteroid. Our leader determined that even if all covens must fall eventually, advertising their demise only pushes the catastrophe forward. Adana decided my power posed a great danger to the peace inside our coven. She concluded that I had to learn to reason instead of relying exclusively on my gift. So I was sentenced to meditate for a millennium deprived of my deck. Since I'm here, I deduce that you don't agree with your leader's judgment. She was afraid of my influence. Many of our sisters put their trust in my advice. I'm sure that hag thought I was undermining her supremacy and decided to cast me out. You sure sound sour about it. Would you kill her? Should you have the chance? No. Isolation didn't eat away your mercy yet, I see. Ugh. Okay. I will help you recover your powers. Will you get me a new tarot deck? Tarot? Pfft, no. I mean, tarot's cute, but it's too human-centric to grasp the hidden truths of the cosmos. You will create your own deck. Ooh! My own deck? I wouldn't even know where to begin. Shh, leave the details to me. That is what these five days of training are for. You're going back to which school, Fortuna? For this training, we will review the four basic elements of magic. Should I be taking notes? <laughs> Air, water, earth, and fire. I should be able to remember that. Oh no. Don't worry, it will be fun. Plus, you'll get to seal a contract with me for each of those energies. Now, get some rest. Tomorrow, we'll start with the invisible energy, air. Lesson two, context. Look how cute this house is, though. It's like adorable. She made her little asteroid so cozy. First day of school. Are you nervous? To be honest, I'm just happy to be able to hear something other than my own voice. Ha, <laughs> that's cool. Today we're going to talk about air. I'm going to focus on what will be useful for creating our own divination deck. <laughs> oh, your apartment's two stories, Scotty? Understood. Oh, because that would have been awesome. Air represents the invisible, the negative space, that which imbues everything. Air is the collective subconscious, energy within community, the ecosystem. Air is everything that surrounds us. Air is context. Exactly. This is interesting because in, in Japanese, uh, I was often told like that I don't read the air. Hey, Duncan. And like, it means context. So it's interesting. Master your air and you will acquire unparalleled awareness. <laughs> Lucas is now daddy shrimp. Um, <laughs> well, it's too bad. I've already entrusted my soul to him. So, uh, <laughs> hey, Al. Hey, Duncan. We're waiting on Aira. Uh, as soon as Aira comes in, then we'll start up Mother 3. I've got my knitting ready and everything. There is power in knowing one's place. Even when isolated, you are one with the cosmos. Now, for the first part of our contract, we will seal our energies together. Adam! Yes, please. As I promised, I will let you decide the nature of every seal. You just need to answer a question. But careful. <laughs> Aww, fist bumping. Y'all are cute. Your answers will affect your fate dramatically. I'm ready. For the air seal, how do you want to be perceived? 
I want to be feared. I want to be adored. I want to be pitied. Oh. Considering I don't want to kill the person. Oh, I don't have to worry about it. This is the tutorial. Uh, I think probably adored is better. Ready for an ego trip, eh? I'm on board. Inspiring adoration will allow you to gather support from many. But be careful you don't get overthrown by your idol persona. I understand. Allow me to seal our energies together then. Ooh. Ugh, that hurt. That felt good. <laughs> Can't you feel the power? Yes, I feel it, but I also feel like I was tearing apart. Well, girl, I am a behemoth after all. What did you expect? I know, I know, I can take it. Good. Now focus on that bit of air energy we unlocked. We're going to use it to create our first card. I notice you have a ceremonial tokonoma for witchcraft in the basement. Oh, good. So you just, like, <laughs> fuck up and that's it. Head over there and I will teach you to create cards. All right. Oh, I don't have to, like, move myself. That's cool. This is the Arcane Grimoire. Select Spear. The Opera House. <laughs> oh, it's the first one. Here you'll acquire magic images that can be used to craft your cards. There are three types. Spheres for the backgrounds. Arcana for the main figure on the card. And symbols to add some magic pizzazz to your compositions. They all cost magic energy to summon. Right now, you can only acquire air type elements because we've only unlocked the air seal. But you can go ahead and browse the grimoire and savor to savor your future creations. Haha. -ha. Okay. Quicksand graveyard. Magical cemetery for the witches. Pleasant prairie. Moonstone temple. Javalana Payash Jyoti. The Road. Demonic Desert Lands. The Shipwreck Library. Charred Battlefield. Vicanus Majoris. Sunset Docks. Jade Monk's Waterfalls. Gem Skull Belt. Nomad Sky Caravan. Titan Quarry. The Hundred Column Worship. Defrenia. The Red Strings Club. <laughs> Forgotten Factory. Magical post office. Opera house. I feel like I'm going to do the opera house. All right. Select arcane. The seed of knowledge. Not enough energy. The harpy herald. <laughs> Side reel lovers. Shaman. The Pilot from the Machina Cult. The Gold Blower. Wolf Mother and Children. Duchess of Solace. <laughs> Pyre for the Heretic. <laughs> Banner Bearer. Forbidden Door to Pleasure. <laughs> The Dragon, Harvest Oracle, 
the Purple Blood Seeker, Deerfolk Paladin, the Bartender, the Avian Dancer, the Florist, the Astronaut, the Fallen Hero. All right, so what I can select Harpy Herald, or I can select the Shaman. All right, there's only two. So the Harbinger of Newfound Paths, the, Har the Herald has been spreading occult discoveries from coven to coven since she was created by the corpse of Archwitch Kodamia. Or the Shaman. Shamans have been taking care of the soul and heart of many tribes since the birth of the mortal kin. These mortals can grasp a blur of the ideas we witches weave into the light of the stars. Hmm. Let's go with this one. All right. Then I have to select a symbol. Bottomless Jug, Asteroid, Ruby Candle Lamp, Onyx Trumpet, Cane of Sacred Wood, Ether Wings, Glass Trident, Something in German, Minister of Secrets, Obsidian Sledgehammer, Fire Whip of Dominance, Igniting Saber, Arbiter Book, Jade Road Keepers, Blue Light Torch, Inevitable Three, Tower Shield, Swordfish Liqueur, Hunter Witch Rifle. <laughs> yeah, something in German. That was important. Dark Matter Bow. Virtus Mirror, Snowcat Eyes, Iron Golem. All right, so the things that I have energy enough for are either the Onyx Trumpet or the Ether Wings or the Arbiter Book. Whatever they write in these books is updated immediately into the grimoire. Mm. One of the most popular spells among beginner witches, the Ether Wing spell not only allows the user to fly, but allows them to gift wings to other beings. Okay, let's do the wings. Now build your first card. You can move the background and drag, rotate, or scale the images around. Add as many images as you want from the stock at the sides of the cards. Don't worry, it won't cost you extra energy. Put your soul into it. But you can move it. And I kind of want to move the opera so that we're like on center stage. Maybe, yeah, up here. I mean, we could do some, like, God Kepka shit here. How many wings can you have? I guess... no? Oh, I can make them bigger. Oh, that's cool. All right. But this has to be on the card, I guess, somewhere. Put that down there. I don't want it. Can I, like, flip it? I guess the answer is no. Mm. 
You can move it. There's a limit. I haven't found it. You can see the bar of buttons. Oh, yeah. Okay. So I just have to bring for. Oh! Send backwards. Okay. That does bring it to the front. I want that to the back. Send to the bottom. What's this? Whoa. Duplicate or trash. All right. Let's trash this. Let's trash that. No, I can't trash it. This has to be here. Top button is flip. Aha! There we go. All right. And I want you to go to the back. There we go. Yeah, we're going to have some Kefka-like wings here. It's fine. Um, there we go. Let's send you to the back. Yeah. All right, and then this thing. Oh. Hey, you. I guess you'll have to hold it in your hand, maybe? Oh, dude, she's got like. She's got like clawed feet. She's got to carry all that mail. I know, right? Maybe she'll put this in her hand foot. There. She's got it in her claw. I'll do another one in the back one. <laughs> Maybe. Here we go. She's got... She's got the mail. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. Maybe, I don't know why we're in the opera house delivering mail. It's fine. All right. <clears throat> Standing ovation, card legend. The chambers of the opera house make all meanings resonate through every context. A strong avatar for justice, imbued with purpose, the ether wings elevates the arcana for everyone to see. The hurricane of air will stir luck and call for the unexpected, meaning leadership, purpose, justice, predestination, and luck. The meaning of a card varies depending on which elements you combine. Okay. Air elements lean toward relationships, community, and karma. Pay attention to your studies so you can tune your divination style towards the ideas you fancy the most. It can be tricky at the beginning. The only way to master this is through experience. Okay. All right, now what? Back? Oh, I crafted a card. Did you like it? Uh. It was a bit confusing, but it looks promising. Looks promising. Feels way more complex than tarot, but I can sense its potential. Good. We're only just getting started. It will all make more sense when you try your hand at reading them. Era? What was this? This is Daddy Shrimp Abramar. <laughs> Daddy Shrimp? Daddy Shrimp Abramar. <laughs> Are you yeah. reading tarot? What the fuck is going on here? This is the Cosmic Sisterhood Wheel of something. I don't know. Mm -hmm. It's it's some game that Scotty said I should play. And it looks nice. Yeah. Sexy. It is pretty damn sexy. So let me see yeah. if I can get to a save point and then we'll get some other three on. Okay. Do you need some food and some time? Uh, Kay is going to be making some veggie burritos. Ooh. So he will deliver it to me in due time. We had veggie burritos for dinner tonight. It was delicious. Ooh, yeah, I I bought some black beans for him to soak and, and put in the slow cooker. 
and because I like how he makes them. Mm-hmm. And we use tofu with oh, a, bunch yeah. of, a bunch of spices and mushrooms yes. as like the, the meat replacement. Uh huh. So good. It's so yummy. Sounds good. So, so tell me, give me the down low of what happened. So the down low is uh, this chick here, who's the main character, has been isolated for the past 200 years because, uh, uh, and she's a witch, and she was isolated onto an asteroid because she pissed off her coven leader by telling them that they're basically doomed because she could tell because she read the fortune. And uh, they didn't like that. No, and so she got exiled, and she's like, "Well, fuck this! I'm gonna call on a on a being." And she calls the behemoth Abramar, and they've made a pact, and he's been sealed away for uh, five thousand human years, and mm-hmm. he's gonna help her get her uh, divination back. So, so now we're learning how to create cards. So we'll wait until you've made at least two cards, though. There's not a lot of predestination in shuffling a single card. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, look at that animation. I'm sorry. You must be tired. Go to bed and review the fundamentals of air. Tomorrow we will unlock your water. Thank you, Abramar. Thanks to you, Fortuna. I will make you happy, I promise. Good night. All right. Can I save? Aww. He wishes you good night. That's yeah. nice. And so then you like get to create cards and put them together. Do not did you be afraid of him, become his master. Did you make that card? I used these elements in the card and made one in an opera house. Ugh. GG, you made a card. Okay. So can I like save? Exit to title screen? Wait, 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 oh, wait, cancel. wait, wait, cancel. Go back to game. Okay. Level three, emo- lesson three, emotion. They Look will make- at that animation. Isn't it beautiful? Look at this. <laughs> I love pixel art. Yeah. Or Fortuna, each day me cometh to teach us thee. <laughs> Why is he talking like that? Okay, so like the first day he's like, oh girl, I've been missing you or whatever. And then like, she's like, I thought you would be more, uh, you know, formal. <laughs> <laughs> and now he's doing it. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, are you ready for Mother Three? Yeah, but let's find a save point. I don't think there's a save point. I think you just exit to the title screen. No, but look at the game saved with the- one minutes ago. Oh, okay. Never mind. Yeah, we're good. It saves regularly. Okay. So, all right. Exit to title screen. All right. Yay. Guess what you guys get to see? You get to see my background. <laughs> For my computer. Give over digital. Hell yeah. I don't know who they that always is. Publish, they always publish some fucking bangers, man. All right. I'm going to turn off the stream and turn it back on. But um, I, I want to show my, my background. 